actually filming on at the same time was Lab Rats. I'm a recurring guest on that, so um, it's really fun, kind of you know, like being one character and then switching to another character. You know, kind of in the same day I was doing it, so it's a lot of fun, and I can't wait till everyone gets to see it and stuff and for it to come out. So yeah. Can you just talk about your character and Jesse that when you're guest starring? Yeah, sure. Well, I play Vincent. I'm kind of like the bad boy in the school, and I kind of am I'm kind of like the president of the whole school. Like I can tell anybody what to do, and they'll do it for me as long as I, you know, give them a little cash and stuff. So um, I kind of flirt with Peyton, and um, it's it's really cool. It's a it's a fun character to play. I just study um, bad fella. Well, it's called bad fellas, but I just study a lot of um, like Godfather type movies and stuff to kind of get in the character and stuff. So uh, it was a lot of fun, and I really like that's like one of the, my favorite roles I've played. So it was a lot of fun. You think it's more fun playing the bad guy? Or the good guy? Oh, that's hard to say. I mean, I, I've always, like, before I did that character, I was always like, I want to play the good guy you know, yeah. every time. So people, but I don't know, I like really playing that bad character. It's kind of fun, you know, everyone getting mad at you and stuff, and you kind of having that evil sense, because I don't get to do that <laughs> in my regular life, so it's cool to express it through the character of uh, Vincent and Jesse. So. And you also have a movie coming out in spring. Can you talk I about do. that as well? Yeah, it's called, I actually have two coming out, Motel Life with Dakota Fanning and Hello Herman. Um, they're both in post-production right now. I got to to do some ADR for both of them uh, recently, and they're looking really good. So I can't wait till they, you know, get accepted to some film festivals, and I get to go to Europe and stuff. So I'm, I'm really looking forward to um, see how far they go. So I'm really excited. Got a lot of stuff coming out. So what was it like working with Dakota Manning and also Emil Hirsch? Yeah, they're great. I mean, Emil and Steven and, and, and Dakota, they're amazing actors and, and actresses. I got to uh, study with uh, Steven a lot. He got to kind of tell me a little bit about the character since I was playing the younger version of him. And He's a really great guy. They're all so nice, and um, I was so fortunate to get to you know work with Dakota and all of them. Like they're really great actors and stuff. So it's, it was fun. Can you tell us a little about your character in that movie as well? Yeah, I play the younger version of Steven. Um, I'm kind of I, I I play the very the climax scene in the whole movie where um, my my leg gets cut off by a train. And I fall off this train, and it's really an intense scene yeah. for me. So um, it's it's really fun though. We got to film out in Reno, and uh, it's it's quite an interesting city. We got to film in. So so uh, it was fun. Was Dakota like what you thought she was going to be like when you met her? Yeah, I mean, she's really just a down-to-earth, you know, girl who, you know, is, is very mellow and, and chill. And, you know, she just seems like a very nice person to, you know, hang around. So she was nice, yeah. And for you, what's, like, your most prized possession? My most prized possession? Well, definitely, like, my family because um, I, I couldn't be out here without them because they, they are always backing me in whatever I do. And, you know, they moved out here with me. And that just, like, takes a lot of personal parents and stuff so I couldn't do it without him and my dad's always calling me every day if he, you know when he's in Colorado and always supporting me and asking me if you know he can do anything for me and stuff so he's really just great and I have a great mom who drives me everywhere and, and, and does my laundry and cleans my room for me sometimes and prints my sides and yellows them out and stuff so she's like really great and I have the best parents and I couldn't do this at all without them so they're the most prized possession I have. Justin Bieber. I like. I mean, that's like the guy I kind of like look on his page occasionally. I look, uh, you know, Debbie's. I look on a lot. Uh, and um, oh, who's, who's a good one that I follow? Will, Will Ferrell. A lot. Of, there's a lot of great people I follow on Twitter. It's, I love Twitter. I love you know seeing what people are doing and stuff. So it's a great way of communicating.